Hey guys, another late video, very good news for the jailbreak community today. Another jailbreak has been released for all 64-bit devices. Now this jailbreak will not install Cydia, but it will give you SSH access and prevent the auto update from iOS, which is very, very important. Now, it's gonna work from iOS 11.0 up to 11.1.2. And very important, make sure you use the website here directly from the developer Morpheus, which is, of course, his link will be in the description down below for you to go ahead and follow him on Twitter if you wish to do so. No more information about the jailbreak as it progresses. Now, injection tweaks in Cydia will be added in the future, just not right now. The developer wants to make sure everything's working properly. The IPA you can find directly on the website here, as you can see right there, I go ahead and download it. I did run this over to Panga, the developer uh, project, and it did work uh, very, very well running over this other jailbreak. So I just clicked the button and you can see there auto updates were disabled, SSH access was enabled and other perks. Now it does work on all 64 bit devices as mentioned. So what you're going to do is go ahead and download City Impactor here and then simply download the IPA from the website right here. Very, very important that you only use this website with this IPA. So go ahead and launch City Impactor and once you download the Liberty Jailbreak, just simply drag and drop it over City Impactor. For those of you who have been jailbreaking for quite some time, you already know how to do this process. Simply enter your Apple ID. Once you enter the email, go ahead and enter the password. And once you enter the password, just simply click enter and it will sign the application directly to your device. So you can go ahead and run the jailbreak. I already tested it, of course. So it is available here on my iPhone. Now, if you have two-factor authentication, disable it before you sign the application. Once you sign the application, then re-enable two-factor authentication on your device in case you do have it enabled. It's very important to have that enabled. So here it is, Liberty iOS. Just click the button, simple enough, and you'll see that it'll automatically start jailbreaking and then you'll get to have SSH access and it will disable the auto updates. So to make sure that you stay on this software, it's very, very important. So there you guys have it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Yet another jailbreak, one step closer to the official thing. Very exciting work here from the developer. Of course, all the links in the description, including the developer's link. And I hope you guys have a great day. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.